Trying to guess at Toggle's behavior puts you in a coma. Neither, make it a surprise and also randomize which side does which. Mate you are looking for a checkbox. I have this conversation with project managers weekly. They want a toggle, I ask what it's for. They give me some double negative thing that doesn't make sense. Rule 101 don't make your user think. As soon as they have to think about something, they'll. Using my own reasoning it should never say enable turning off feature or enable, disable or anything of sort. If the toggle enables animations the text should just say animations. If it enables invisibility it should say just visibility. It should never use negatives. If the feature is on by default the toggle is on by default and vice versa. Color form for state, text for purpose. I distinctly remember there was a time when people experimented with this, and large, realistic switch types were replicated in GoAs. I'm talking end state rotary dials, red LEDs lighting up, chunky metallic toggles you know the ones, the works. Bonus points for matching sound effects this choice lives on and does up to this day, particular in audio effect stacks. Seems like some devs think if you're holding a guitar, you suddenly become incapable of any abstraction. My guilty pleasure is quietly liking those. At least they're communicating intent clearly.